and Caleb Daniel joins us at the Gabba right now. Caleb, I don't know how you went through the game. I know you've just watched the highlights. We're out of breath. Brad Johnson's nearly had a heart attack three times tonight. He's punching on with Jonathan Brown. It was unbelievable for the people who barracked for the Bulldogs. Them of the Bulldog breed. They were so excited tonight, mate. Tell us what your thoughts are right now. Uh, yeah, I'm pretty speechless at the moment watching those highlights and I'm just glad a couple floated out on the fall. It was um, pretty special to be out there. Obviously, a few crazy efforts from the boys and um, yeah, we're just stoked and it, yeah, it's just nice to come to enemy territory that, you know, Brisbane brought a really good energy, the, the crowd and, and the players as well. But, you know, our supporters really stood up against it and um, it's just great to get a win. Caleb, 10 points down at three quarter time. What was the coach's instructions? What was the feel? Because you came out of the box, kicked those first two goals and suddenly the pendulum swung you away. Yeah, I think we ended up um, playing some pretty good footy towards the back end of the third quarter. They probably got on top of us in that third quarter early early, and we came back and we had some momentum. So, um, yeah, the momentum was in our favour and we were able to just do do what we do and, and play our brand and, and that held up. And, um, yeah, look, like I said, I'm a bit lost for words at the moment. Well, Caleb, you're sensational. Next question comes from the man who played 364 games in the red, white and blue, Brad Johnson. He smiles on his worst day. He should see him tonight. He can't <laughs> stop smiling at the moment. <laughs> Caleb, congratulations. Great game by yourself. You used the ball extremely well. We highlighted that through, throughout the game. Taylor Duray, have you had a chance to catch up with him? Because that last effort to stop uh, Charlie Cameron one out was pretty special. Oh, he's a superstar. He's a, probably one of the best team players I've ever played with. And it's, um, like I said, he's, he's a special player. And the way that he's, you know, attacks the game and, and the ball and the opponent is, is second to none. So um, we always knew that he was going to do that when he got a little bit of a role. I think he switched up there and um, after half time and he, he played sensationally. So, um, like you said, that last effort, oh, I was coming back and trying to help, but I was cooked, so I was no <laughs> chance. I'm just glad that he got that ball out of bounds. Caleb, what about that deliberate out of bounds? Your <laughs> thoughts on that? <laughs> oh, I won't go into it. I wasn't too happy. But, yeah, it's all good, though. Um, we're standing here with the wind, so wrapped. Fair, fair to say you weren't trying to kick it out of bounds at yeah, that stage. It's fair to say that. <laughs> no, it's fair to say that. Yeah. Caleb, uh, second quarter, you got cleaned up at the centre bounce. I know you weren't in there, but uh, you made an adjustment at half time. It looked as if Tim English certainly rucked a hell of a lot more in the second half. Yeah, he did, and um, he played a tremendous game as well. You know, we brought Louis up um, to the stoppage around the ground, but that centre bounce was was a little bit um, one-sided throughout that first half. So Timmy really stabilised us in there, and um, he had a huge game. His attack in the air, um, you know, going back with the fly for such a big man. He's great below his knees, and, and he brought you know what he does. So um, it was super from him, and yeah, we're wrapped uh, the way he played. Last question, Caleb. What what from here now? You've got to go in for the team meeting, I gather. What's the movements from here to get to Adelaide now? Uh, we fly to Perth, I think. I haven't actually heard, but I'm pretty sure tomorrow morning. Um, fly to Perth and then um, to Adelaide whenever our game is. So, uh, yeah, that's our movements from now. But OK, so you'll, now you'll, go, you'll go into the into Perth quarantine now and, and then fly out to Adelaide and then back into Perth. Is that what's going to happen, is it? Yeah, I think that's the, uh, that's the go. OK, mate. Well, good luck. Hopefully they let you into Perth. There's been a few issues with it this week. <laughs> Fingers crossed for us. Good on you, mate. We wish Thanks, you all lads. the best. Good on you, Thank Caleb. You. Sensational job tonight, mate, and congratulations again. Caleb, well, Daniel.